Meantime, CARICOM leaders band together to show their support for Guyana and urge parties who contested March 2, 2020 elections to adhere to the ruling of the Chief Justice. The Chief Justice of Guyana ruled yesterday and her ruling was absolutely clear that she expects the returning officer to either start a new or complete the process with respect to the SOPs. And we hope and pray that there will be an adherence to the not just the law of the judgment but to the spirit of the judgment because she was very clear in the last few paragraphs of her judgment as to what she expected in terms of the spirit and the principled position and the transparent process that is critical if this country is to go forward. Prime Minister of Barbados and current Chair of CARICOM, the Honorable Mia Motley, at a media briefing at the Marriott Hotel in Georgetown about noon on Thursday. Following the delegation's arrival in Ghana on Wednesday, Ms. Motley said they met with His Excellency President David Granger, the executive of the APNUAFC, leader of the opposition Bar Jagdil, members and executives and presidential candidate of the PPP, Irfan Ali. The delegation also met with representatives of other small parties and election observers. Later on into the night, another meeting was held with President Granger and the leader of the opposition. We, the leaders of the Caribbean community, are committed to working with the people of Guyana for a free and fair process and transparent process. And we made it clear because there is simply too much at stake for the people of Guyana. Guyana is Georgetown is the home, the seat of the Caribbean community. Guyana is a founding member of the Caribbean community. And against that background, we are clear that as a community of sovereign nations, we cannot get involved in the internal processes, but we are family. And family does not stand by and watch others in the family suffer without making themselves available to be able to aid the process. Ms. Motley said both sides committed to abiding by the laws of Ghana and constitution of Ghana. The delegation included other CARICOM leaders, Prime Ministers of St. Vincent and the Grandines, Dr. Ralph Gonzalez, Grenada, Dr. Keith Mitchell, Trindan Tobago, Dr. Keith Rowley, and Dominica Roosevelt-Skerritt. Felicia Valenzuela, InfoHub.